Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today is day four of my amazing Disney fantasy cruise at Christmas time, and today we are in Tortilla. Let's do it. So I've never been on this island. I am so excited to get out there and explore this place. We are going on an excursion to something called Jost Van Dyke Beach. We have to take a boat, another boat, take a taxi. There's all kinds of things. So let's do it. from Disney so they took us right from the boat you know it was um, it, it, in the beginning it was like oh my god okay this is kind of like an ordeal to get here like you end up going on a ferry for about 30 40 minutes not really a ferry it's a small like boat um, with everybody else and then you get over there and then you have to get a taxi but it's it's all planned so it all it works seamlessly and in the beginning I was like is this worth it and yes God. the water everything about it was beautiful the lunch was incredible you get a drink ticket for lunch and you get a drink ticket for one rum punch <laughs> which is really cute honestly though by the time that you make it there you want to just jump head first into that water which is exactly what we did so now presto we are back on the boat and I do have to say our our ride back on the boat was really fun because he was just blasting disco tombs and giving us rum punch all the way back so that was really fun and um yeah that was an absolute blast that was such a great excursion it was a little bit more than a hundred dollars a person i'd say it was worth every penny to find the best beach if that's what you want to do um, and I just like sticking with the Disney excursions because I don't know these islands and I don't really know how to get around and I don't know what's good and what isn't so that was really really fun. Now tonight it is pirate night. I am a wench tonight and uh, I don't really know what pirate night means but no matter what we are eating at Enchanted Garden tonight. I haven't tried that yet. I looked at the menu. I'm super excited about that so um, again just happy to be back on the boat.
one of the rotational dining options that we're finally trying um, after doing the, you know, Remy and Palo and uh, and then of course we did Animator's Palette last night and that is also part of the rotational dining. So this is the Garden. It's absolutely adorable. This place is so cute. Very charming. You know, I think my fiance just said it to me. He's like, should we have done the two best restaurants like twice in a row, uh, you know, on the first couple of days? And it was like, well, it was Christmas. And yes, we should have. So, sorry. We started like really high end and very spoiled and now we're very spoiled. So, you know, the food is good. It's not amazing. It's the avocado uh Ahi tuna tartare is delicious. Um, there's a nice little mushroom tart. But you know, it's just like... We're spoiled. We're spoiled, that's all I can say. And our server is amazing. Her name is Maria, and we love her. And um, it's, you know, it's so comfortable and lovely. And, you know, uh, concierge, again, I think I talked about this before, but you do get your own table, which is nice for us so you don't have to share but um but yeah you know it is what it is so but it's a very sort of chaotic um atmosphere like i don't want to say cafeteria but it's pretty loud and it's pretty chaotic um it's just a completely different universe than palo or remy so just fyi don't um don't be shocked by how completely different it is. Oh, look, here comes my back. It's a pirate knife, I think. Honey, our. 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 <laughs> Very bright and sunny out here and absolutely gorgeous. We are going on yet another excursion today, so I am super excited about that. Well, today is day five of my Disney Fantasy Christmas Cruise. So I am so excited. I have never actually spent time on St. Thomas. St. Thomas is one of those islands, like it's one of the biggest Caribbean islands and it's a place where a lot of the times you will sort of transition from island to island, but you'll land here. So I haven't spent a lot of time here. Um, so I'm super excited because we're doing an excursion today. We are going to this like super secluded beach area. Um, it looks amazing in the pictures. It's called Sapphire beach we're gonna do some snorkeling we're gonna hang out and uh and there you go so i'm super excited let's do it
it's a mixed bag. <laughs> I would say this beach is spectacular. It's gorgeous. It's very rustic and very different from yesterday, which is fun. Um, it looks incredible. It's a little rough. I would highly recommend getting water shoes. I don't have those. And so um, my fiance was like, these are out there like forever already. But like, you know, you kind of just want to be careful with like sea urchins and it's very rough. really good. I think it's about $60 a person, so that's not horrible. Now, there's no drinks included, there's no food. This is lovely. Everything is it's just not slapped together. It's not, you know, like hot dogs and hamburgers and stuff. I think you can get that stuff out by the pool, but this is definitely um definitely I was dancing alone in the wishing corner. My door was there, my own heart beating. What has always been for a memory that's faded by the minute. It can build you up. 
wonderful day five. Oh my gosh it was so much fun just absolutely loved st thomas loved our excursion to sapphire beach i highly recommend it if you're looking for excursions it is a perfect snorkeling beach it's super relaxing you don't get a lot of time there um and it is a half an hour safari jeep ride which was also part of the excitement <laughs> very fun um but yeah, it was definitely worth it. It's kind of a weird port because, I mean, maybe it's just the way that we did it, but um, or our ship does it. Uh, we arrived, we had to be there at like 8 o'clock, and then we left by like 11.30. So it's just a nice little like morning snorkel ride and, you know, morning snorkel uh, excursion. And um, it was really fun. So I highly recommend it. I loved that. And then just basically enjoyed the ship for the rest of the day and toodled around and yeah and just did some trivia and stuff so that was my day five thank you guys for joining me and i'll see you soon <laughs>